Hey, hello and welcome to Ambition Success. My name is SK Imran and you are watching chapter Ways to Online. In today's video, I will show you how you can subscribe Microsoft 365 using our referral code. The process I will show you over here will create one email chain through which I will provide you the setup link. And if you want our technical support, then that email chain will be useful. Not only that, I will also provide you various updates whenever we will upload any new video not only about Microsoft 365 but also other products and services on which we create videos. Most interestingly, here you don't need any domain at this point at the time of subscription. You can add your domain later. So, Let's see how you can subscribe Microsoft 365 using our referral code without any domain. So everything starts from our website which is ambitionsuccess.co.in and once you are inside our website then click on contact us page. And then fill up this page with your information this form as I'm filling with some demo example then here select the channel from where you have seen or received this information I'm selecting LinkedIn then in this select Microsoft Office 365 setup link and then click next and then scroll up and then submit once you do this you will receive one email from us which will look like this and inside that email we will request you to confirm your email id by replying to this email what you have to do you have to just reply by mentioning confirmed that's it send it and then you will receive another reply to the same email chain which will look like this and inside that you will find the link of that page where you will find our affiliate link so click on that and then you will be redirected to the page as I have just shown it here so then from the available affiliate links select the plan you want to subscribe for example basic standard and premium here I'm selecting standard and you will be redirected to Microsoft 365 website where you have to click here try for one month and then here enter your email I am providing my free email ID here at this moment which is this and we'll click on next so looks like you need to create a new account let's get started continue as this so i will click on setup and here i will provide my information here i will provide my phone number here i will provide my company name here i will provide my company size and when you click on next so now it will send me a verification code to my mobile number I will click here send confirmation so here one important thing this username is what you will use to sign in each time you use your app this domain name is a suggestion you can change this domain now or later at any time with your own customized domain so whatever is showing here right now 
you can use that and complete this setup process later you can change your domain so username is this and domain name is this so i can change this to admin and then i will remember this what i will do i will click a notepad and write it down here admin on microsoft.com now put your password and remember your password also now i will not change anything over here i will click on next see creating account please do not refresh this page so here it is showing microsoft 365 business standard price is also showing now i will have option to add payment method so what i will do i will go ahead and add payment detail so for security reason i will blur or skip few parts of this form and once i am done with this i will return back over here after clicking on save and then this is confirmation that the card number i have provided is valid so i have received one otp to my registered mobile number of that card so i will put that otp here i am blurring for security reason and then i will click on submit 2 rupees will be deducted which is refunded so now i can check and if i want i can provide my gst and also as pan is mandatory over here so i am inserting my pan for security reason i will blur this or hide this so now i will enter my pan id once again and then save and then as we can see it is showing the base amount then the tax and then the total but don't worry you need not to pay anything because you are in trial so that's the reason the total today is zero so don't worry you need not to pay anything today so what i will do i will click on start trial as you can see as you can see it is processing and as you can see thanks for signing up for microsoft 365 business standard trial your username is this what we have already noted down over here we can verify and a confirmation email is sent to this so you also copy this email id so i will go to my email where i have received a confirmation as you can see your microsoft 365 business standard subscription so it is over here and it is done you can use the email id which you had noted down in notepad and that password to use all the services of microsoft 365 i will show you how i am opening one browser and then in the address bar i am clicking outlook.com and then I'm clicking on signing in and at the same time I'm opening the notepad and the same file which I had saved here so now here I have to write the email ID which is this and then I will click next and then I will enter password so here it is asking to set up various security protection but as this is demo so what I will do I will skip for now
and I am inside my Outlook and here is the same ID. So I, as I mentioned I can use all the services and I can send email also for example and I'm opening my email so as the email ID is little bit odd it is inside junk but if you just mention not junk it will be inside your inbox as you can see so this is the free email id and the free domain which you are using right now and here inside the sent items you will see the same email so this was it you have just learned how to subscribe Microsoft 365 without domain. In my next video, I will show you how you can add your domain, verify your domain and connect your domain with Microsoft 365 so that you can replace this odd looking email ID with your favorite email ID. So thank you for watching. See you in next one. Till then, take care. Bye bye. But before that, Wait a minute, don't go right now because you have acquired a very powerful tool right now. What's the use if you have a sword but you don't know how to battle or how to use that? Why don't you use it to automate your business? If you want to do that, then watch these two videos and you will learn how to automate and save cost and time. Check it out and let me know in the comment section what else you can automate or what you want me to show you in automation. Finally, thank you and goodbye.